Hi, I'm Gary Parker. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can see God, the Garden of Eden, and the Third Temple, all in a 2012 NASA photo of Egypt's Giza Plateau. It's simple, it's easy, and the photo was designed so you can see everything. And all you have to do is follow my instructions. Number one, you must use a laptop computer. And number two, you must be in a dark room. Pitch black is best. Number three, you have to Google ISS032-E-009123. It's going to appear on the screen, but it's ISS032-E-009123. Dash E dash zero zero nine one two three. Then what you'll see is NASA pyramids at Giza, Egypt. You click on that and that will take you to the NASA website where you will see the photo, the NASA photo. When you get to the NASA photo, you must scroll down and on the right hand side, click on where it says full size. If you don't click on full size, you won't be able to zoom in or out enough to see all the images in the photo. Okay, great. Now I'm going to show you how to find the Garden of Eden on the NASA photo. Okay, this is the location. You're going to look at the photo normally, the way it looks normally. And what you're going to do is this road coming up here that intersects with the Nile River is called Ring Road. It's like an eight lane freeway that goes through Cairo. It comes down and it goes onto the Giza Plateau and it turns into a white wash. Can you see it? It's a white wash right there. The Garden of Eden is just above the white wash. So what will happen is I'm going to show you how to zoom in, how to tilt the, the laptop so you can see everything. And we're going to and remember to your right is east to your left. I'm sorry. To your right is west to your left is east. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with the serpent which is over here. I have a little drawing of it. I outlined it. So we're going to get to the laptop. We're going to, you're going to see it normally, and then we're going to zoom in so you can see it, what it looks like when the, when the camera's tilted. Okay, everybody, this is Ring Road right here. It's coming out of Cairo and going on to the Giza Plateau and it's moving west. Okay. What we're going to do is going to move a little bit more west. If I can find my pointer, there it is. Here we go. As we're moving forward, Ring, uh, ring Road or the White Wash starts to go down right here. If you can see it, you can kind of see a thing. Let me, let me zoom in just a little bit more. It looks like a snake, a serpent. There's a head, there's the body. Can you see it okay? Okay, so everybody, right here, like I said, is Ring Road. Just above it, you're going to see these black squiggly lines are going to turn into white rapids to a river, a blue river that's flowing left, which would be east. Then, as you see, hovering above here, it looks like a snake or a serpent with a long tail. Here's his head. When we tilt the camera, when we tilt, I'm sorry, when we tilt the computer, you're going to the screen, you're going to see that the, the serpent or the snake pops out like a 3D photo. OK, and he's going to be blackish, bluish, whitish. And his, his tail is going to go all the way down. Okay, here we go. Tell me when you're ready. Okay. Right about there. Can you see it? Yeah, right there. Can you guys see it? And you can see one right, can you see one bright red eye there? Not two? Yeah, right there is good. Okay. And what you do is you see he's, he's hovering above the river here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go left and I'm going to show you just a little bit left, which is east, I'm going to show you the Tree of Life, and her name is Asherah. But first, I'm going to show you a picture of her so you have that for your, um, so you, you'll be able to pick her out easier. This is Asherah, the Tree of Life. She's just east of the serpent. And uh, she's giant. The branches and everything, you're going to see it. I'm going to show it to you on the laptop. And uh, like I said, she's just east, and you'll see the Blue River once we tilt the, the uh, screen you'll see the river flowing under her. So that's it. Here we go. Okay, here we go. We're moving to the east. Here we go. You can see this is the Blue River, the rapids. And we're going to go see the Tree of Life here. 
There we go. We're going to move down a little bit. We're losing the serpent a little bit. We're going to zoom in. Oh, one more time. Here we go. Okay. As you see, the serpent is here. And this is Asherah. This is the tree of life. She, you can actually see her long chin, her mouth, her nose, and she, her eye is closed. These are all branches. And right here, you will see a bright, just one little strip. It's like, it looks like it's on fire. That's actually the flaming sword. But let's concentrate on Asherah. Here we go. The serpent is down here. You ready for the tilt? Mm. Can you see her? Here's her chin, cool. here's her mouth, here's her nose, here's her eye. Right there. Can you see her? Yeah, right there. She's kind of bluish and whitish. Mm -hmm. And all above here are all the branches of the tree. Yep. And here, like I said, can you see the one flaming sword, the, the, the flame there? That's the, that's the sword or the flame that actually, it lights up God, what's written on a lamb that's in God's hands, and also the tree of life. What we're going to go now is we're going to go a little further east, and I'm going to show you Uriel, who is the cherubim who guards the east gate of the Garden of Eden. Okay, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you, first of all, now we're going to go see Uriel, okay, the cherubim that guards the east gate of, uh, of the Garden of Eden. Then we're going to zoom out so you can see it all as like a mosaic or one picture. Okay, here we go. We're going east. We're leaving the uh, Asherah, the Tree of Life. Here we go, and here we go right here. If you can see right here, there kind of looks like a dis distorted head, almost like a distorted Ronald McDonald. And here's his neckline. Well, what's gonna happen when we, when we tilt the computer screen, he's gonna have black hair, he's gonna have around his neck, it's gonna look like he's wearing a wetsuit. And on his right eye, which is, our, which is your left side, it's going to look like he's wearing a mask. Okay, what that is, is the mask is actually a raven. On his right side, he's a raven. On his, on his um, I'm sorry, on his uh, right side, he's a raven. On his left side, he's a lion. When he looks straight on at the camera, he is, uh, he's human. Okay, here we go. Tell me when to tilt it. Yeah. Tell me when to stop. Good. So everybody, the thing is, everybody's different. So your eyes are different. So you might want to zoom in a little further, a little less. Just know this, if you zoom in too close, the pixels break up and it gets too blurry. So you have to play with it and you have to take some time. You got to put some time into this. Now we're going to zoom out so you can see everything at, at once. Ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Now, as you can see, there's the serpent, here's the rapids, here's Asherah, the tree of life, here's the flaming sword, here is Uriel. So we're gonna tilt it back so you can see what it looks like tilted. You ready? Tell me when to stop. Okay. How's it look, wild? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. Now, um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to see the third temple. Here we go. Can we turn the lights back? Okay, back to this. What I'm gonna show you is I'm gonna show you how you can see the third temple. It's already built, it's with these It's with these beings, okay? And it's in the photo. In detail, it's in the photo, okay? And first I'm gonna show you on this, and then we're gonna to go to the laptop, okay? First of all, this is the third temple. It's right in God's face, okay? His whole face is the temple. Right where, right where we circled it before and you zoomed in and saw the, saw the, the being that I showed you, uh, that I drew, what's gonna happen is that's at the top of the temple. That's right at the top, that's where he is. Then, when we tilt it, you're gonna see this building. This building, if you go by the scale uh, of the NASA photo, this building is around 15 miles wide and five miles high. So are those exact dimensions? I don't know, but that's, I took them off of the photo. So uh, what you're also gonna see is that the three pyramids are gonna look like they're on fire when we, tilt the, when we tilt the laptop. And you will see that they are in the entrance, uh, right in here, they're in the entrance and it's very bright. But up here, you're gonna see a, 
A man's, uh, the, the outline of a man, he's going to have a head, arms, that's right in the front as you go into the temple. Down here, though, you're going to see walls, and these are huge gates, and they wrap all the way around. Also, the temple rooftop is flat. So we're going to look at it on the, uh, on the, uh, uh, the laptop, and let's give it a shot. Let's zoom in on it closer. Okay, go ahead. Okay, everybody, here it is. Now, here's the, here's the photo, and just remember... The walls and the gates are here, and then up right by where his nose is, where the three pyramids is, that the three pyramids are, that's the entrance. And you're going to see an outline of a man. He's going to look like he's on fire. But then you're going to see all out in here is going to be the temple. Okay, here we go. We're going to zoom in a little bit. Exciting, right? Here we go. I may have made it too big. All right, like I said, this is the top. This is going to be the top. This is the man in here, his arms and stuff. And then you're going to see everything else. Here we go. Tell me when to tilt it. Did I move it too close? Mm -hmm. You're good right there. Tilt. There. There. Okay. Now, like I, now I, I can't see it. Can I see it? In, can you hold it and let me look at that? Okay. Okay, everybody, this is a tougher one to see. This is, you're going to have to take my word for it that um, you're going to have to do this at home and really look at it. Like I said, this is the, the, the roof, the side of the roof, and then it kind of indents like this, and then it goes down here and it's kind of like in a, almost like a tent, like a huge tent, like a V, and then it goes back. So it's really hard to explain since you're all not sitting here in front of me, but I got a feeling you're all going to see it because that's the way this was designed. So do your best. Feel free. To, you're, I'm going to put my email on this video. So feel, feel free to email me. And uh, on the next video, I'm going to uh, show you how to find uh, Abraham, Isaac, Moses, David, and Jesus. They're all in here. And uh, it's extremely exciting. So that's it. Thanks a lot, guys.